Hey, what's up guys? It is Double Kisser again, and welcome once again to Napoleonic Total War 3. That is true, we are back. I don't know why I've got the vanilla background. It could have something to do with anything, don't ask me why. But we are running 4.0. Uh, last time we played as the UK, but which, by the way, we did end. People need to pay attention when I do say that we end a campaign, and when it simply ends for an another reason. If it ends for another reason, I'll state why. If it's the save is broken, if it's utterly boring, if it's a pointless situation, etc. We took out France and we pretty much had no other enemies on the map, so I decided to end it with a grand sea battle and call it a day. Uh, I'm not the kind of guy that aims to place the UK and then take over the entire world with no other enemies to fight at the end. I don't find it boring. I think about 25 uh, hours of gameplay or whatever or, or, or series over a month or less is just about enough to to sort of you know cover that nation and now we're gonna play as France and you can imagine that this campaign is gonna be a lot longer because France pretty much already hates everyone else in the world we're like the Nazi Germany of this time we're, we're here to take everything uh, we're not like the the allies that we kind of played in the last uh, NDW3 campaign they just had to neutralize this one threat being France so as you can already tell Obviously, because of the thumbnails, we're playing as France. Uh, you've got the Imperial Legal, the French Imperial Legal, and some French infantry, cavalry, etc., etc., in the thumbnail itself. I made this thumbnail for some quite some time ago, so I was already, I already made up my mind to play as France. France is a beautiful nation, and we are going to play it. 4.0 brings a lot of other cool things into the game. New units, uh, new AI. This one is really the, the single-player kind of update. So I... Uh, We'll enjoy to jump in as, uh, I think you believe, you jump in on the campaign to the coalition. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. This is the one. Now they've got descriptions and everything. I believe every faction does. Uh, but everything is, is good. France. Empire Francais. And we're going to go with the world domination. Uh, what's this? No, the historical one is cool. So we own all of this. We need to take all of this. I went with the historical one as well before, I think. Battle difficulty is hard. I think... What did we run with with the UK? Because the campaign difficulty, hard. I think we're going to go with hard. Because I want a slightly more, you know, of a, of, a, of, a, of a challenge. I don't know what we played as on the UK. I might have to go back and look it up. Well, I think we did medium there. Uh, perhaps hard as well. I'm not sure. But we're going to go with hard, hard. I think we can handle that. And we're going to start the game because I've got nothing else to say, baby. Oh, yeah. So, as far as Total War campaigns go, uh, after this one, I want to play as Russia. Uh, really try Russia out. Never have. Uh, perhaps there'll be another update by then. I'm going to make more multiplayer videos of this game. And uh, another Total War campaign that's coming up is actually my Union campaign for uh, American Civil War. Obviously, way outdated or way updated since we last played. But welcome! Welcome back to Napoleon Ick Total War. We're allied with the Italians. Feels good to know. Jean André Mazena, okay. Mazena, oh, look at this. Chasseurs à pied. Battalion. À pied. On foot. One year regiment de Okay, scouts down south. Gentlemen up here. Ooh, Marine de la Garde. Uzards. Ooh, Carabinier, Grenadier, Fusilier, Voltigeur. Fusilier, Dragon. Okay. Oh, Napoleon Bonaparte. Oui. And we've got Ney hiding here as well, and we have. Davu hiding here as well. That's a small one. That's a ne <laughs> look at this bold head. Netherland battalion infantry man two. Okay, there's a spy. We're allied with them. We're allied with them. We're at peace, but we're at peace with Prussia as well, and we're allied with them. So we're kind of allied with everyone but England. We're at war with England. We're allied with them. We're at peace with them. We're at war with. I think I'm gonna march down on Gibraltar. Um, this is my navy. Uh, this is a trade route. The first thing that I think of is just actually raiding this trade route. Should be good for the income. Uh, I don't see a point of putting our fleet to any other use. And then, of course, gaining another trade post that hopefully isn't already used. I believe this one is empty. Uh, we have no trade ships, so uh, mind you, we'll just raid this one instead. 
Uh, it's back and forth going either way. Greece. We're at war with the Austrians, of course, and Russians. And Sweden. Ah, interesting. Um, fuck you, Sweden. Hanover here. A bit of a frontier. So, 14,000. What do we begin by upgrading? Well, we begin by upgrading these things. The clearances, the stud farms, the supply warehouses, the vineries, the manufactories. And I'll try and balance what we upgrade. Uh, manufactories, lumber mill, factory, clearance. We did get a manufactory last time, so now we can get a... Uh, that is a artillery in this region. That's at the French artillery up there. Um, I believe it was, it was Caen that we... Yeah, the industry in Caen. So that's artillery there. We can get that there. Uh, this is in the region of... Paris? Yeah, this is in the... In the I believe so. Market... We get the gunsmith then. 1% on 100 is like a 99, 200. No, it's a little too little actually. I think I get the supply post. Replenishment rate. The replenishment rate. I think I get that there. And then here, I will just get the market. In call. Skip through some of these that we've been through. Mm. Not gonna upgrade that, gonna upgrade this. Mm, might as well upgrade that. Ooh. Members Club. College. College could be good to have. Supply post, we've already got that gunsmith. Get the supply post up north there. Let's get that little mine going. These basic structures I don't mind upgrading. Oh, we could use. Uh, we could use. Um, Supply post out there as well. And that's it. Now we've gone through pretty much every smaller building that needs that 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 first little upgrade. This one already has a gunsmith. You know, you can tell the price the price range is uh severely different. Uh trading wise, we're not really trading with anyone. Um, which is a bit of a bummer. We should get should get a commercial port in here, because I find it fairly safe. Uh, commercial port there as well. So now we kind of blew all mo blew all of our money on that. Uh, there's a bunch of bridges here. There's a weird war with these guys. So I am gonna pull back a bit and hold the crossing right there with Mazena, uh, allied with Switzerland. We cannot cross here, so I will put. I want these guys to move in a in a big force. We're going to send this guy not here because I'm pretty sure I already know what I need to target. I could begin by going down south, but you never know when Prussia is just going to stand up and fight you. So there's one crossing from Prussia over here. I don't feel so threatened by the one over here. There's, there's one over here, this one here. This one, The closer one is obviously up there. So I'm going to send Napoleon. And I'm going to send Napoleon to... I'm going to merge Napoleon and Davu. I'm going to send Davu to Strasbourg. And I'm going to take his section. Merge. There's a lot of cavalry in here. And then I'm going to send this little sexy set up there. And I will keep everything in. So we're just going to head to the technology tab. We have conscription. What are we researching? Nothing. We only have Orleans, which is kind of bad. We should get another college soon. Uh, Grand Battery. I like the land drainage. The classic economics first, and then we'll do the land drainage. Just to get that extra money. And what are we... Getting 827 next turn, so that's going to be, uh, we're quite sucked in here now by the, the other costs, so it's good that we're upgrading these buildings. We also need to get some trade going, so mind you, I'm going to go here. We can trade with Prussia, and I think 
trading with Prussia seems like a pretty good idea. Uh, obviously, they're close. We can also trade with the Ottomans. Yes, I will pay ten. What a wonderful, what a wonderful uh, deal, actually. Uh, marvelous deal, marvelous deal. Denmark, I feel, would be nice to trade with as well. Uh, we can also trade with the Kingdom of Sicily. They're a bit down south. I think Portugal has more to offer. They're unfriendly, so we'll take Regno de Napoli. Um, well, while we can trade with others, we'll get a land trade route with Hessen. Sicily might as well just be added to our Italian trade sphere. Fuck, if we can trade with you, we'll trade with you. That's 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 my Sure you're a little unfriendly with me, but there we go. We've pretty much saturated all our trade and our next income will be four thousand six hundred and fifty eight. It's so important that you pay attention to this guys. I could have just like clicked the turn and missed out on that but i'm playing it smart now i'm playing it on hard hard and when you play it on hard hard you get like this hmm, okay i gotta play a little smarter in the medium medium you know i gotta play a little tighter gotta play a little cooler gotta play a little better you know i don't know why my accent door now hey so next turn 4500 again okay so i think we're gonna play it like israel here before we get attacked by everyone, we attack everyone in the nearby area. And obviously that's the way to do it, and you break everything and you just utterly destroy them. Uh, I think that's a winning strategy. It has proven to be. Um, yeah, you will hold on here with artillery infantry, and you will secure our coast down south. Uh, I feel like breaking Gibraltar while we can. It is uh, not too much of a strong fortification. We have the Spanish armies nearby, so I think I will indeed... Dispatch a general to head down south. Now, who will I pick? I think... Was it Davu? Or was it Masena that went down south? I can't remember. I sent Davu. He is one of my most most uh, experienced. I'll give him carabiniers, cuirasses, and artillery to begin his recruitment. And I will also send him to uh, Reims. Picardy Champagne, where he will gather a force that we need to recruit now. Wow, the recruitment time has really gone up. Uh, Fusilier de Ligne. Voltigier Company, two, two Voltigier Companies. And of course his, uh, his famous artillery here, so that will be good. Where is our college? There it is. Wait, we can buy another. We could build another college nearby. Feels like something we should totally invest in. A theater. Okay, that's good. We need to get these small artillery buildings. Hanover. What can you get? Nothing else right now. Drill school is probably worth it because you're going to be the fucking heat of the battle. So I'll give you that. It's a smart idea. These cities in here. Not much. Not much. They already have really what they need. Rain cannot get much. Flanders can give you a cannon foundry. Things like that. Sounds like a good idea. Down here, it's pretty quiet. I like my French Empire. It is. It is. It feels like we have the borders protected. We don't have too many enemies yet either, which is obviously a, a good advantage. I hate having a lot of enemies. Who doesn't hate having a lot of enemies? Um. So we're really sucking up the trade of this right now. And I, I do intend to get closer. Closer, 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 closer with my ships. And the second I can send this one here and this one here at the same time, I will merge the navies and lay siege to Gibraltar. It'll all be in time for the actual attack. We're here to take it. I don't care about what the French thinks. There are allies. There are vassals, really, indirectly. Don't tell them, but they are. And uh, I intend to make it uh, make it shown or prove it. Okay, so Napoleon is up here with his mighty army. He's just going to hold outside Cleve. If if the Prussians do attack from the east at Hanover, <laughs> well, I'll I'll take Cleve. Simple as. Uh, Michel Ney, um, you can hide there in the woods. Looks very, very innocent. Yeah, diplomatic relations. You want to become allies? Okay. No, 
Swiss Confederation, our allies, allies, allies. Looking for the ones that are friendly. Kingdom of Sicily. Allies. No. Little to command us, so we gotta wait a bit. Spain, our allies. The Ottomans. Okay, we'll end the turn again. Moving into Bavaria there. Oh! I'm not really afraid of any, like, fleet invasion here. What the, When they hit me, I'll hit them back. That simple ass. There's, there's no other way. Fucking Antwerp. Hmm. So it's gonna be a bit of a hit to the income. They're attacking the Netherlands as well. Bastards. Okay. Fine. I will kick them out as easily as they came in. Gonna get some Gard National to put in the harbors once we kick them out. Seems like the right thing to do. Gard National. We have one, two, three, four. Okay. Five. There's a gentleman here. Um, hmm. Where could we build another college? Was there a way to. To only have one in, in throughout the entire France is a little, little on the thin, you know. I'm gonna give this army some some reinforcements. Okay, the Austrians do get a little tangy down south. They just took that, so now they can really spearhead towards uh, Stuttgart. Maybe I should partake in such a battle instead of just sitting back. But I feel that like this river is really at my advantage. If the Austrians do take it, well, we're going to have a bit of a <laughs> confronting issues up here. We all know that. But the Prussians at the moment are staying calm, and that's that's that makes me feel kind of alright. They're not jumping the gun on anything here. The Swedes, mm, I'm at war with you, but you're staying relaxed at the moment. Uh, hopefully the Russians will go to warn you. Can you could I buy in one turn later? Dead. Okay. I think the British hitting the British now will be will be just very good for us. Okay. We'll move him around. The British didn't do anything this time around. Nothing unexpected. Recruiting a lot of troops here for the Empire. The French Empire. One more turn and then we'll head down south. I want a bit of a an extra buffet when it comes to the army itself. Where's the National Guard? Right, we'll send one de Havre. And we'll send one to Brest. We'll send one to here. And one right here. Nope. Oh. Dock protection. Doesn't really cost any cost us anything doing that, but uh, Commercial port is going to be needed. We'll get a dry dock. Although I feel that this look, these these locations are a little, little um, you know, they're a little out there. They're hanging out there. <laughs> I don't know how to put it. Just going to make it sound even worse. Um, uh, right now I'm waiting to be attacked by the east. I'm not going to attack anyone uh, over here until they actually. Head towards me. I'm going to station my spy right in between Innsbruck and Munich, so get an idea of where they are. Uh, and for the for the other time, I'm just going to actually be heading for Gibraltar. Mm. 
Is that a Victor Dorand? Ah. Okay. Because the Spanish don't seem to be to be doing much of any work at the moment, so we'll just wait and then we'll head down with a swift army and take it. I don't think putting two gentlemen there is Oh yeah, it's it's kinda worth it. If we don't have another college, we might as well. They can sit there and argue over who's the smartest, and then we'll end the turn. <laughs> Could you imagine them doing that? Trying to get that research together. Okay, I knew it. I think we need to put a put a unit of National Guard in each harbor. It's something, you know. Because the, the, the cost that it's gonna, you know. The British Navy is the British Navy. We don't have much to, to argue about here. Okay. 